Okay, the dust has well and truly settled here at 114 today. Um, just a bit of a progress video. We decided today to order the plasterboard, the timbers and the insulation for the renovation work. If you look up, what I'm showing you now is, is the outside roof. The house was built with only two spars across the bay. So this area here, I'm going to change the roof spars and do them horizontal, not vertical. And we'll put in some wool insulation. Um, so that should keep it warmer because it was built with no insulation and was probably very drafty in winter. So that's the first job was to get the bay reinstated, um, which should be done tomorrow. That's firstly making all the spars fit and going that way we'll be able to put more in. Then I'm going to put a sheet of plywood, quarter inch plywood attached to that because the plan is to have uh, American shutters, American blinds, which are quite heavy. So they'll have to be supported and screwed in. So that's job number one. And then the windowsill, it's presently plastic. So we're going to get one full piece and make it out of one using the existing plastic windowsill as a template and make that and fit it. There's no damp in the front room, which is a good sign. Um, generally everything's okay. Uh, the house was rewired, so when the plasterboard comes on Tuesday, it'll be the spot and dab method where basically you mix the adhesive, it's powder, in a bucket of water, um, apply it to the wall, and then you fit the plasterboard to it, uh, just using a plank of wood and a hammer to hit it without damaging the plasterboard, and that should give you a nice flat surface to put your finishing coat of plaster on. We've decided to use a stone lintel for the brick hearth. So that's going to probably require building the chimney out. A couple of bricks out from here and sitting a stone lintel on. Cleaning all the bricks up as we did in the back room. Taking the old, raking the old mortar out. Then putting in a white mortar. Um, a snow creep into it, clean the bricks off and then we'll have continuity from the back room to the front room. Um, the ceiling, as you can see, is still got thousands of those little tacks, all the lats against it. Now we've left a couple in because we've got wires and some copper pipe up there, but tomorrow we'll remove all the tacks and use cable um, clamps to put everything so it's not sagging and then we're going to fit some insulation in there for soundproofing and warmth so although we are you know took a few steps back when it's all reinstated um, it'll be much cleaner much warmer and we'll get that nice flat smooth finish for any plaster work that we do should we decide to paint the plaster work or continue with the wallpaper so yeah um not really a lot done today. I think it was a day of rest and to watch the World Cup. So tomorrow we'll start again. The tools will be out and it'll be an early start. And hopefully we'll have something to show you, some finished work.